Great! So, here's the garbage, Marvel. Okay, Marvel, let's pick up all the trash. And don't forget to find out the mystery of why the garbage truck didn't show up. Okay! Wow, it's a living garbage truck. and calculations with numbers and stuff. But my screen just shows the wrong things. Wow! That's so special! More for like, more for like! <laughs> Sam! That's really cool! You're not garbage! Do you want to be our friend? I would love to be your friend. Stuff. Throw them in the garbage truck, Morpho! No, don't! That garbage can be reused! Just like me! to build. A doggy. Doggy. I love garbage. Okay, more for the garbage truck. Now let's bring all the garbage to the garbage dump. This is the garbage dump! The gate is closed! We can't go in! Where is the garbage man? Garbage man, where are you? Hmm, it's a mystery! Bank, bank! Hey, the robot doggy smells something! I think the robot doggy has found the trace of the garbage man! Let's follow it! Hey, garbage man! Why are you here? Why are you not picking up the garbage? I don't want to be a garbage man anymore, so I got myself a new job. Here, at the flower store. Flower smells so good! Much better than garbage. Yuck! I really don't like garbage. 
You don't? I love garbage. Robot new garbage man! I could build so many cool things out of all this garbage. I'll get started right away. Wow! That's a beautiful house! We'll have lots of fun living here. Won't we, Dougie? Bark, bark, bark. It's time for us to go home now. Bye! Bye-bye! Okay, Morphle, we are moving with all our animals from this old zoo to our brand new zoo, all the way across town. Okie dokie, Zookeeper Kenneth. I will bring all of these animals if you bring the biggest of all. The blue whale. But even though they're big, they're not scary. All they eat is plankton. And they love plankton. Oh, and there's one more thing. You have to be very careful of the animal thief. The animal thief loves stealing animals. Okay, we will be very careful. Thief is getting away. Na, 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 na. We will bring you to the other side, officer. Na, 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 na. Da, 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 da. You've been very bad, Animal Thief! You cannot just go around and steal animals! You are going to jail! Now let's bring the animals to the new zoo! Let's go, Morpho! <laughs>
will have to be very careful with this. This is my big box of scary monsters. My scary monsters escaped. I'm on my way. think so? I think you're a fluffy sweetheart. It's not okay to scare people, monster. Morphle! Morphle! Morph back into yourself! Huh? Morphle? The monsters from the Magic Pet Store are scaring everyone, but Morphle is not a real monster. <laughs> ah, the real monsters! Stop scaring everyone, monsters! <laughs> Scare me like that! Hey! Hey! The monsters are scared of Morphle! You're a monster scaring monster! You don't have to be scared of Morphle! He's a friend of mine, and he's actually quite sweet and fluffy. Here, you can pet him. You see? But it doesn't feel good to be scared, now does it, monsters? You shouldn't scare other people either. Monsters should help people to not be afraid of scary things. Mm. Yeah, just like I helped you guys to not be scared of Morphle. I'm scared of the doctor. The monster is not scared of the doctor. You don't have to be scared either. to ride a bike. The monster will help you to not be scared. <laughs> Let's pretend that we're monkeys in the jungle. But we cannot touch the floor. That's where the crocodiles are. You know what 
would make this game even more fun? If you would morph into a real crocodile. <laughs> you can't catch me, crocodile. <laughs> Mila, Morphle, I have something I want to show you. Ah, a crocodile! Don't worry, Daddy. It's just Morpho. He's just pretending to be a crocodile. Oh, well, if it's just pretend, it's okay. If it's just pretend, it's okay. But come, there's something I want to show you guys. You see, I got a very special new magic pet. The Papa Jungle. It has the magic powers to create jungles. They say that the Papa Jungle is one of the oldest magic pets and that it created all the jungles of the world. But now I'll get changed. You two can play with Papa Jungle for a bit. Yay! Hi, Papa Jungle. Do you want to play? We cannot touch the floor because that's where the crocodile is. And he's gonna eat us! Wow! Look, Morpho! Now we can play in the real jungle!
prickly bushes. Now we won't be able to get it out. That plant is way too prickly. Morpho, morph into a robot. Aren't you scared? Morpho the robot, no scared of anything. Yay! Hey, I saw what your robot just did. My dog went into a dark and scary cave, and I need help getting it out. It went in here, but that cave is so scary. My photo robot, not scared of anything. We could use some light in here. There it is. <laughs> Wow, you saved my daughter's doggy from that scary cave. You are truly afraid of nothing. For saving the mayor's little pet doggy dog, you, Morpho the Robot, get this award for being afraid of nothing and a great doggy dog hero. Yay! Hello, Mila and Morpho. I am a scientist. Wow, Morpho. It's a real life scientist. Morpho, we need your help. You see, our space satellite broke. Okay, Morpho the robot, you will need all these spare parts to fix the satellite. But, but, Milano, go? No, Morpho, you can't take me with you this time. You have to take all these tools along instead. Don't worry, Morpho. We will keep a close eye on you from my laboratory. My photo robot, not scared of anything. Very good, Morpho. Up you go. Morpho made it to space. First, fly to the moon. Yay! Great! Morpho made it to the moon. Okay, Morpho. Now wait here for the satellite to pass by. Morpho, there's the satellite. You can go fix it. No, Morpho the robot, scared. Oh, poor Morpho. He's scared. Morpho, I thought you weren't scared of anything. M Morpho, scared we without Mila. Robot Morpho is scared to be alone. Mila, I guess you have to go up in space anyway.
Watch out, Morpho! Meteorites! Morpho the robot, they're scared of anything! Amazing! Morphle the robot, I am blown away. Just blown away. You did not just save a doggy dog, you also repaired an important satellite in space. You are truly not scared of anything. Morphle the robot, no scared of anything, uh, only Mila, I'm with Morphle. Mila, Morpho, Zookeeper Kenneth called. He says he needs your help at the zoo. Okay, Daddy. Morpho, morph into a flying house. Mila, Morpho, great, I need your help. We are going to release all these animals into the wild as part of our wildlife rehabilitation program. But my airplane can't fit all the animals. Could you and Morpho help bring this penguin, camel, and monkey to their new homes in the wild? Sure. Great. Come, we can all fly in Morpho the flying house. On this globe, you can see where these animals live. And this is some food for on the way. See you later, Zookeeper Kenneth. Bye, Mila and Morpho. We will bring all of you to your new homes. First, we bring the camel to the desert. The desert is hot and dry. It's the perfect home for a camel. Morpho, look! It's a dragon! I think he wants to come with us. Dragon no like desert? No. He doesn't seem to like where he lives. But we can find a new home for him. Right, Morpho? New home for Dragon. We're bringing these animals to their new homes in the wild. And we will find a new home for you too, Dragon. First, we're heading to the South Pole. But since the trip will be long, let's play so we don't get bored. Dragon. <laughs> the rainforest is the perfect home for a monkey. 
Maybe you will like it here too, Dragon. The monkey wants to barbecue those bananas. Uh-oh. I think the rainforest might be too wet for dragons. It's not easy finding the perfect home for a dragon. But we're not giving up. <coughs> Look, Morpho! It's a volcano! This is a perfect place for a dragon to live! Swimming in hot lava. Ooh. Okay, dragon. You seem very happy in your new home. Now it's time for Morpho and me to go back home. Bye, dragon. Bye bye. found those eggs with my time machine. They were just laying there in the past with no parents to take care of them. Morpho! Morph into a Triceratops! Dinosaurs don't exist anymore. But with this special time machine, we can find different dinosaurs from millions of years ago and zap them right into our time so we can study them. But we don't need this one here right now. Let's send him home. Oh no! Mila, use the time machine to zap me back into our time! I'll try! Yes! Great! Now zap me! Oops! Oh no! Try again! Now we can't send the dinosaurs back to their time. 
You and Morphle have to go find my friend, Professor Tsong. She's a scientist too. She will be able to fix the time machine. Okay. Watch out, Morphle. That's a T-Rex. T-Rex no eat babies. Let's go, Morphle. We have to find Professor Tong. Come, Morphle, this way. The dinosaurs are walking all through the city. Watch out, Morphle! It's the T-Rex! T-Rex no eat babies! This is where Professor Tsong lives! Professor Tsong! Mila, Morphle, what's going on? Please help us fix this time machine! We need to zap the T-Rex back into its own time! Oh no! The T-Rex is almost here! Okay, all done! Quick, Morpho! Zap him! <laughs> They fixed the time machine! Now let's send the other dinosaurs back too! Thank you so much for saving me, Mila Morpho. I've talked about it with Professor Tsong, and maybe it's best if we send the Triceratops babies back to their time too. But you said the eggs didn't have a mommy or daddy to protect them. Uh, yeah, but... Morpho, no send back babies. But we can't keep them, Morpho. Mommy and daddy only allow me one pet. And I already have you! Don't worry, Morpho! I know how we can find a good home for them! Look, Morpho! You should morph into a floaty shark too, so we can play with our friends. No, wait! Morpho should morph into a real pet shark. Morpho, morph into a real pet shark. A big and scary one. Is Morpho mean now? He looks so mean and scary. No, Morpho is a super friendly shark. Right, Morpho? Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Morpho the friendly shark. People, 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 can I please have your attention? You should never, ever, ever throw garbage on the beach. For example, there's garbage floating in the sea right there. 
this is bad for all the cute little fishes. Oh no! It's a shark! You all need to hide! But Mr. Lifeguard, this shark is a friendly shark. No, 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 no. I don't believe it. Sharks are never friendly. Help! Help! My poor little jitterbug has been swept out to sea. Look, Morpho. Jitterbug the dog is in trouble. Somebody has to save it. Morpho, save! Oh no! That shark wants to eat that little dog! No, no! He doesn't! He wants to save the doggy! Don't be silly, little girl! It's hero time! Shark, the little kids were right. You are a friendly shark. He is. It's my pet, Morpho. Do you want to take a ride on his back? Stop it. That's mean. No, we're not gonna stop. Because we are pirates and we do mean things all the time. Hey, just look at those mean pirates. You know, Morphle, we all know you're a friendly shark now. But those mean pirates don't know you're friendly. <laughs> look, look, look! <laughs> now, let's help this little fella rebuild his sand castles. Great! Now we can take all these stones with us to the building site. Okay, Marvel, let's go! Let's go! La 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 la! We need all these rocks to build houses. Okay, Morpho, drop them here. Okie dokie. Uh, 
Using a hammer, we smashed the rocks in the right shape to build houses with. And this is where we build the houses. We lay the stones on top of each other and build houses. It's lunchtime. You really love houses, don't you, Uncle Lawrence? Yes, I do. Because houses are the most important things in our lives. What was that? Look, look! Something here is eating its way through the houses. Oh! What could it be? Look! <gasps> wow! It's a stone-eating monster! S stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! You cannot just go around and eat people's houses! Houses are the most important things in our lives, and you cannot just take them away from people. But Uncle Lawrence, I think we took the monster's house away first. Huh? The stone-eating monster came out of Morpho the dump truck. He must have lived in the pile of rocks. I is that true, stone-eating monster? Did we take away your house? Uh -huh. Well, that's terrible. We're going to bring your home back to where we found it. Okay, Morpho, let's give the monster his home back. Yeah. That's okay, Mila. We'll find rocks somewhere else. I think he wants to show us something. Follow, follow. Huh? I think he means he could use these rocks. Yeah, w with a lot of hard work, I could turn those rocks into houses. That looks amazing, stone-eating monster. Now for the finishing touches. Wow, Uncle Lawrence and stone-eating monster, these houses are great. We're the lake house. Yeah, I say we're a great team, stone-eating monster. We should work together from now on. Sire. Morpho! Morph into a tow truck! Great! Okay, Morpho. Two, 
the garage. Hello there, we have a flat tire. Whoa, it's a living tow truck. That's amazing. It's called Morpho. If I could use your living tow truck for the day, I'll fix your tire for free. The first client we need to help is the ice cream man. His ice cream truck broke down. Okay, hook him up, Marvel. I'll have his ice cream truck fixed in no time. Uh, thank you, uh, Marvel the tow truck. Here, have uh, some ice cream. Ice cream! The next tow job is going to be a little bit more challenging. Wow! That truck is so big! Morphle! Morph into a giant tow truck! Well, have I ever... Okay, Morphle! Bring this truck back to the garage. W wait, M Morpho! I forgot to close the truck properly. Morpho, wait! La 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 la. Oh, no! Look! It's the ice cream truck! Morpho loves ice cream! Ice cream man! We need your help! If Morpho sees the ice cream truck, he will stop for sure! Here you go, Morphle. For every car you bring back, I'll buy you an ice cream.
Oh, fixing a car is such hard work. Morphle, morph into a toy car. Hey. Daddy, play. <laughs> Morphle, I, I have to work on the car. Daddy, play, Daddy, play. <laughs> <laughs> Morphle, stop it. <laughs> Could you please be quiet? I'm trying to mow the lawn, and your laughter is keeping me from my work. Oh, sorry, Mr. Vanderboos. But I guess you two are right. Sometimes it's good to take a break from work and have some fun. Morphle, morph into a real car. Another living car. Yes, it looks just like the other one. Another living car? Professor Tsung was just here with a living car. That sounds interesting. Can we go to see the other living car, Daddy? Of course, but I'll get back to fixing my car. Professor Tong? Hi, Mila Morpho. Wow! It's a living car, just like Morpho. That's so cool. Yes, my team invented this special device. It can zap machines to life. We used it to zap this car. And we have been running a lot of very interesting tests on it. But now it doesn't want to do the test anymore. We don't know why. Car no have fun. Car need fun. Oh? Yeah, Morph was right. Sometimes it's good to take a break from work and have some fun. Ah, oh. fun! I wanna play soccer. Are you going to play soccer with us, Professor Tong? No, Mila. I'm afraid I'm too old to play soccer. I'll watch. But then we need a fourth player to make even teams. I have an idea. Daddy's car could be our fourth player. Huh? Over there and make those loudly laughing kids play somewhere else. I need to concentrate when I'm mowing the lawn.
What? Do you want to come play soccer with us? We need an extra player to make the teams even. Now that the big truck is playing with us. No! Of course I won't come and play with you. I have work to do. I need to mow the lawn. I have a solution for that. Now the lawn will be mowed. And you can come play soccer with us. You can't always work. Sometimes it's good to take a break and have some fun. <laughs> <laughs> Morpho, do you know what I want to be when I grow up? Uh, a panda bear. <laughs> no, silly. I want to be a bus driver. Oh, a bus driver. Morpho. Hello there. To the police station, please. Yes, sir. Can I please see our ticket? Oh, hi, Mila. I'm going to my laboratory. Okay. This naughty monkey and myself are heading to the zoo. Sure. I have to go to my auntie, the witch. She lives in a little house up on the highest mountain outside the city. Oh, your aunt is a witch? Yeah, and I'm a witch too. My auntie sent me a magic wand for my birthday. I'm going to visit her so she can teach me how to use it. The wand never works the way I want it to. Hmm, that sounds important. We should bring you to your destination first. Okay, Mr. Police Officer. Morpho, to the big mountain outside of the city. Zappa's here, Zookeeper Kenneth. 
I didn't do it on purpose. The little witch girl was right. This magic wand is difficult to use. I'll try one more time. Magic wand, bring us back home. Oh no! We're in the ocean! Morpho! Morph into a floating bus! I don't think we should use the magic wand anymore. We should bring it back to the little witch girl and her aunt as quickly as possible. Morpho! Morph into a flying bus! Let's fly to the mountain top where the witch lives. We brought you your magic wand. We tried to use it, but it didn't work the way we wanted it to. Well, I know how to use it very well. The trick is you need to make your magic spell rhyme. Where do you need to go, ma'am? To my laboratory. Pay close attention, my student. Magic wand, please do something for me. And bring this lady to her laboratory. The next thing I want my little wand to do is to bring these two fellows to the zoo. And this policeman is also in the wrong location. Please won't bring him to the police station. Now you try. Okay. So, Magic Wand, please go ahead and bring my new friends to their bed.